Hi, my name is Prasenjit and I work for BMC Atrium Orchestrator product. In the first part of the BSA 8.7 and BAO 7.8 integration series, we talked about the prerequisites for BSA integration. We created a file deploy job in BSA and also configured and deployed a BSA adapter on the LAP peer. In this video, we'll see how to write a sample workflow to test the integration. This is my CDP machine. Let's open the Dev Studio. Let's connect to the BMC AO grid. Go to the library first. Click the import modules from repository and let's select the BMC Blade Logic AD Operations Manager. Click the import button. Over here, we can see the status of the import. It says import successful. Now let's go to the designer. Over here, we can see the AD operations manager. Let's right click and create a new module. We'll name it BAO underscore BSA. Create a new process. We'll call it test integration. Okay, let's expand the AD operations manager. Select perform BLCLI command. For the connection detail, provide the adapter name. Select XML from the drop down. So, over here, this BSA 87 adapter is the exact same name that we have provided on the grid. Click the OK button. So, we're going to create a quick workflow which will retrieve the list of all the servers added in our Blade Logic console. Let's make the data type as string and type in server. For the command, we'll provide list all servers. Click OK. That's it. Let's see if we can retrieve the list of all the servers from the Blade Logic console. Okay, over here we can see we have the BSA app server as well as the CDP server. So the workflow looks good. Let's modify the workflow to execute the BSA file deploy job. Hit Ctrl L for auto layout. Let's provide the connection details. Provide in the group name. Let's provide the job name. We need to provide the same job name as we have in the Blade Logic console. This is what we created in the first video. Click OK. Over here, we also need to provide the connection details. Click OK. For the job key, we need to provide the context item. the DB key.
select it and hit OK. Now let's save and execute the workflow. It says the process terminated in completed state. Let's go to the BSA app server to check the job logs. This is the Blade Logic app server. Expand the job folder and right click on the file deploy job. Click show results. Right click over here and click show log. As we can see, the job executed successfully. Let's see if the file deploy job copied the text file to the CDP machine. Now I am on the CDP machine. Let's open this file. Looks like the job executed successfully and our BAO BS integration is a success. I hope you enjoyed the video. Stay tuned for more Atrium Orchestrator videos.